What's going on, friends? Happy Thursday to you. Got a day and a half until the weekend, thank God. Um, nice weather out today here in Southeast Texas. It's been like Seattle down here for the, I don't know, about the last week or so. Thank God that's over with. We've got a beautiful day out. Um, supposed to have a beautiful day tomorrow. Hopefully it's beautiful where you're living. Hopefully you don't have any bad weather or anything. Anyway, today, today starts our baseball softball. Uh, kind of wait till each season's over before we get started on the next sport. Otherwise, there'll just be a bunch of crap to do and all that stuff. So anyway, hey, before we get started, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss anything. Um, got some news and headlines here, a few here. We'll do those and then we'll get to some some uh, scores and highlights. Um, former, former Arizona Cardinal and Texas Tech coach Cliff Kingsbury. He is joining Lincoln Riley and the USC staff. He's going to work with quarterbacks. Um, never saw anything if he's going to be a quarterback, the quarterback's coach, or he's just going to work with them. Don't know, but anyway, Cliff Kingsbury is going to USC. Uh, Syracuse's Jesse Edwards enters the transfer portal. Uh, he averaged 15 points a game, 10 rebounds, 3 blocks. He's not happy at Syracuse, I guess. Uh, UCLA's Tiger Campbell. He joins Jaquez Jr. and Jalen Clark, declaring for the NBA draft. Uh, Arkansas freshman Anthony Black. He's entering the NBA draft. He averaged 13 points a game. Uh, Texas freshman Dylan Mitchell, NBA draft also. Uh... Duke's Kyle Filipowski, he's staying put. He says he is staying there at Duke. I guess he loves it there. Uh, Louisville forward Jalen Weathers transferring to transferring transferring to North Carolina, leaving Louisville, going to North Carolina. Uh, sad news here: former LSU basketball player Wade Big Daddy Sims, fifty-four years old. Unfortunately, he passed away. Uh, nothing was given. Nothing was said how he passed away or anything like that. Uh, played under Dale Brown, teammates with Shaq. Uh, played in four NCAA tournaments from 1987 to 91. Uh, prayers to Wayne Big Daddy, all his friends and family, former teammates. Uh, uh, 54 years old, man, that's uh, that's just crazy. I don't know what the deal is. Like A lot of people I know are dying in their 50s. A couple friends, uh, Guess famous people, my brother-in-law, fifty in the fifties. I don't know what's going. What the hell do we do? All of us in our fifties. What the hell do we do to where we're going to die here in the next few years? Uh, crazy, crazy, crazy stuff. Um, hey, Big Ten, they got a new commissioner, former Major League Baseball and TV executive Tony Petiti. He's going to be the next Big Ten commissioner, and I believe they said that starts uh, May fifteenth. So there you go. Hey, despite losing back-to-back -back games to Michigan, Ohio State Athletic Director Gene Smith says he has confidence in head coach Ryan Day. Um, I don't know why he wouldn't. Yeah, you lost to Michigan, but you're tearing through everybody else you play. But I mentioned I'm in my 50s. Some of you younger folks may not remember this. Uh, John Cooper, great coach. He was there from uh, what the late '90s into the 2000s. Always went 11 and one, and that one loss was always to Michigan, and they ended up firing him. I'm not saying Ryan Day is going to lose to Michigan every year from now on, but keep that in mind. Uh, if you lose to Michigan, even though you're 11 and one, Ohio State has no problem getting rid of you. So there you go. All right, like I said, baseball. Here we go. We're going to review this week, going back to Monday. Monday. Number 19, UConn beat Central uh, Connecticut 10 to 4. UConn's Broadhurst, home run and three RBIs. Uh, Padilla, he had three RBIs. Also, Quigley had 10 strikeouts. Number 14, Campbell beat number 17, Coastal Carolina 9 to 4. Uh, Harrell for Campbell, a double that led to three runs scored in that one. Uh, Coastal Carolina's lucky, he doubled, hit two runs in. Uh, number 21, Texas beat Texas State 5-2. Flores for Texas. He doubled two runs in. Uh, Larry for Texas State tripled. He knocked two runs in. Number 8, Stanford beat number 22, Texas Tech 6-4. Uh, Stanford's Hinkleman hit a three-run homer in that one. And Texas Tech Harrelson, he hit a two-run double. Tuesday, number 20, UConn beat Bryant 11-3. Uh, Morton for UConn. 
two-run home run. Um, Hosmer for Bryant. He had a solo home run in that game. Number 17, Coastal Carolina beat number 14, Campbell, 5-3. to three. Uh, Coastal Carolina's Bourne had a solo home run. Beach, he scored on a wild pitch. Uh, Halstead for Campbell. Halstead and Harris each scored on wild pitches for Campbell. Sounds like a game full of wild pitches. Number 7, Virginia, 18. Richmond, 0. Uh, did a wreck for Virginia. Hit a grand slam. Anderson, he also hit a grand slam. Richmond, they had four hits in this game. Number 21, Texas Tech beat number 8, Stanford, 11-2. Yeah, Texas Tech White had a two-run home run. Harrelson, two RBI singles in that one. Uh, number 11, Boston College beat Harvard, 5-4. Uh, Vitrino, Roche, and Wayne, all for Boston College, solo home runs. Uh, rounds for Harvard, he had a two-run double. Number two, Wake Forest beat Appalachian State 10-4. Uh, Corona for Wake Forest, two-run home run. Wilkin had a solo home run. Bennett, two-run single. Uh, App State, this guy here, Zerb. I think that's how you say his name, Zerb. Uh, anyway, he hit a two-run home run. X-U-E-R-E-B. I guess that's Zerb. Zerb. Uh, Pepperdine beat number 22, UCLA, 8-7. Uh, Messino for Pepperdine, three-run double and an RBI single in that game. Sheen hit a two-run home run. UCLA Schreier, he hit a solo home run. Knight hit a two-run single. Number three, Florida beat Florida State, 5-3. to three. Uh, Florida Evans had a three-run home run in that game. Tibbs had a two-run double for the Seminoles. Number nine, Eastern Carolina beat Old Dominion, 7-3. to three. Uh, Cunningham and Hoover, two-run home runs each for East Carolina. Uh, Beal struck out nine batters. For Old Dominion, Fitzgerald hit a solo home run. Edwards hit two run singles. Uh, number 13, North Carolina beat Queens of, I'm guessing of North Carolina because it said NC next to it. Anyway, Tar Heels beat them 10 to 6. Uh, North Carolina's Alvarez, three run home run and an RBI single. Queens, North Carolina, Monaco, two run home run. Sosa hit a solo home run. Florida Atlantic beat number 15. Florida Gulf Coast, 5-4. to four. Uh, Hardigan hit a two-run double for the Owls. Florida Gulf Coast, Rodriguez, though, hit a three-run home run. Number 16, Tennessee beat Eastern Kentucky, 14-2. to two. Uh, Tennessee's Chapman and Moore, three-run home runs each. Uh, Eastern Kentucky's King and Corlo each had solo home runs. Number four, Vanderbilt beat Northern Alabama, 14-2. to two. Vanderbilt had 13 hits in that game. Uh, number one, LSU beat Tulane, 11-5. to five. Uh, LSU's white, two-run double. Joker all had a two-run home run. Uh, Bongart for Tulane, two-run home run and an RBI single in that one. Oral Roberts beat number 18, Oklahoma State, 8-5. to five. Oral Roberts to stall, uh, three-run home run. McMurray had a two-run triple. Uh, Oklahoma State's Binge and Brighaman each had a two-run home run. Uh, number six, South Carolina beat South Carolina Upstate, 7-2. Brewer and Petrie for South Carolina, solo home runs. Uh, four of their runs, four South Carolina's runs were walked in. Um, South Carolina Upstate, Tillman had a solo home run. Number 25, TCU beat Abilene Christian, 7-5. Uh, Texas State beat number 19, Texas, 9-3. Uh, Texas State's Ramirez had a two-run double. Dixon struck out seven Longhorn batters. Texas's Campbell and Daly, solo home runs each. Uh, number five, Arkansas beat Little Rock, 21-5. to Borofen, um, Borofen, I guess that's how you say his name, and Call hit two-run home runs each. Uh, Cali had a two-run single. Little Rock, Arkansas. 11 hits in that game. It's crazy. He only scored five points, but oh well. Uh, number 24, Arizona State beat Grand Canyon 13 to 10. Arizona State's Hill, three run home run and a two run single. McLean had a two run home run in that one. Grand Canyon's Gregory, three run home run and an RBI double. Arizona State had 16 hits in that game. Grand Canyon had 18. Uh, number 23, USC beat Cal State Fullerton 4 to 3. That's crazy. Cal State Fullerton. Used to be on top of the baseball world. Not so much anymore these last several years. Uh, USC had nine hits. Cal State Fullerton had seven hits. 
going to Wednesday last night, or last night and yesterday. Number 11, Boston College beat Dartmouth 14-10. to uh, Boston College is weighing two-run home run and a two-run double. Honeyman had a three-run home run inside the park. That ball did not leave the yard. Uh, Dartmouth Sarez, two-run and solo home run in that one. Uh, number seven, Virginia beat Mount St. Mary 16-4. to uh, Geloff for Virginia, two-run home run. Uh, Saki and Gadbout, two-run doubles each. Some of these guys' names, I'm just like always, I'm going to butcher them throughout the season. Uh, Mount St. Mary's is draw ball. He had a two-run home run. Little Rock beat number five, Arkansas, 11-4. to Little Rock's right. He had a two-run home run. Weatherly struck six Razorback batters out. Uh, Arkansas Slavens, two-run home run. And uh, Bobacher, he had a solo home run. Uh, Bybee. He struck out six Little Rock, Arkansas players. Uh, number 10, Louisville beat Bellamarine, 14-2. Louisville's Cook, two-run homer. Scales for Bellamarine, he had a solo home run. Uh, Louisville, 21 hits in that game. Moving over to softball on Monday, number 13, Duke beat Elyon, 4 to nothing. <clears throat> uh, Duke's Tapia, two RBI singles and a sacrifice fly for a run. Uh, Elyon, zero hits in that game. Number 14, Texas A&M beat Mississippi State 5-1. to uh, A&M's Woolley hit a two-run triple. Cook scored on a wild pitch for Mississippi State. That was it. That was their only run. Uh, Tuesday, number 8, Clemson beat South Carolina 4-3. to Clemson's Cagle hit a three-run home run. Gonzalez for South Carolina hit a two-run home run. Uh, South Carolina's Gayborn, though, struck out eight Clemson batters. Number 22, Utah beat Weber State 10-4. Uh, Utah's Bonstrom, three-run triple and an RBI double. Lopez for Utah struck out seven batters. Uh, Weber State's Ho hit a two-run home run and a solo home run. Number 7, Tennessee beat number 20, Virginia Tech 11 to nothing. Uh, Tennessee's Gibson, three-run home run. Rogers struck out seven, no, six Hokie batters. Uh, number three, Oklahoma State beat Tulsa 9-1. to Oklahoma State had 13 hits in that game. Central Arkansas beat number 12, Arkansas, 4 to nothing. Uh, Central Arkansas, Central Arkansas, Central Arkansas, seven hits, zero errors in that game. Uh, number 15, Alabama beat Samford 6-2. to Crazy seeing Alabama not in the top five. That's just nuts. Uh, Dowling, three-run double and an RBI single for the tie. Sanford's Bruce had an RBI double. Number 24, Indiana, beat Louisville 10 to 5. Uh, Stone for Indiana, five RBIs on two hits. Damn. Uh, Louisville's file, file uh, hit a solo home run. Number 16, Baylor, beat number 25, Louisiana 2 to 1. Uh, Hat for Baylor, solo home run. Credor for Louisiana, solo home run. Number 1, Oklahoma, beat number 11, LSU 3 to nothing. Uh, Sooners, Britta, had a two-run home run. Ball struck out 13 LSU batters. Wednesday, number 19, Kentucky beat Bellamarine 13-4. Kentucky's Caulfield, grand slam and an RBI double. Blanton, two-run home run and a two-run single in that one. Bellamarine, the Bellamarine's Cornerman and Hargrove, two-run home runs each. Uh, number 13, Duke beat Eastern Carolina 11-5. Gold hit two-run home run for Duke. Tapia had a two-run double. East Carolina's Edwards solo home run in that one. Wilson had a two-run single. Uh, in six innings, Notre Dame beat number 24, Indiana, 9-1. to one. Tid for Notre Dame, seven strikeouts in that game. Number 18, Northwestern beat Illinois, 6-1. to one. Uh, Northwestern's Williams struck out six Illini batters. Number four, Florida State. Beat Jacksonville two to nothing. Number twenty three Florida beat North Florida six to one. Another team Florida crazy to not see them in the top five in softball. That's just crazy. Uh, Florida's Road Thomas Eccles each hit RBI doubles. North Florida's Jackson hit an RBI double. Number six Georgia beat Georgia Southern nine to one. Uh, Kerpix for Georgia struck out eight Georgia Southern batters. Number nine Texas beat Texas State four to nothing. Uh, Texas Atwood had a solo home run. 
Samuse, two-run single. Uh, Morgan struck out six Texas State batters. Number 13, Oklahoma State beat UT Arlington six to nothing. Win for Oklahoma State. She had a three-run home run, and Naomi had an RBI double. Number 14, Texas A&M beat number 25, Louisiana, four to two. Uh, Aggies Cannon, she had a solo home run. Catrill had a two-run single. Uh, Louisiana's Longoliers and Creeder, solo home runs in that one. Uh, Louisiana actually had five more hits than Texas A&M in that game. Still lost. Uh, number 13, Duke beat Eastern Carolina 4-3. to three. Duke's Davidson, two RBI doubles. Curd struck out eight East Carolina batters. Right in the middle of the seasons here. So we got some good games coming up. Uh, series that start tonight. Uh, baseball, number 12, Kentucky versus number one, LSU. That series starts tonight, tonight, tomorrow night, and uh, Saturday. Uh, number six, South Carolina versus number four, Vanderbilt. That series is going to be this weekend. Number two, Wake Forest versus number 10, Louisville. That's going to be this weekend. Number 16, Tennessee versus number five, Arkansas. That series gets under the way. Over on the softball side, this weekend, you got number seven, Tennessee, versus number 19, Kentucky. Number six, Georgia, versus number 23, Florida. Number five, Stanford, versus number 22, Utah. Uh, those are some of the big series they are going to be going. Uh, like I said, baseball, the one starts tonight. Is that Kentucky and uh, LSU? Yeah, that starts tonight. The others might start tonight. May just do it Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Anyway, yeah, uh, so basketball season's over. We are right in the meat of baseball and softball. It's going to be getting pretty good if it isn't already. Uh, anyway, we'll be back to uh, review what happens uh, today, Friday, and Saturday. We'll do that on Sunday. Uh, get caught up in baseball, softball. Who lost? Who didn't lose? Who's going to drop in the rankings? We'll see all about that Sunday. Meanwhile, stay busy. Got the rest of today. Got tomorrow. Then the weekend is here, like we said before. Thank God. Um, be safe, and we'll see you next time.